Hey YouTube, this is Eric from Tumple Up Fishing, and we're on another tuna trip. So I got Mike with me, I got Ivan with me, got Oleg with me. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take a sabiki rig, and we're gonna cut the sabiki rig in half, and use half of it on each rod. All right, so basically I'm just gonna take the sabiki. It's got four hooks. I'll cut it right here where the four hooks are. I don't use a weight, so it doesn't really matter. Just cut right there. I got two two rigs. Basically what we do is we take the shrimp, we bend them like this, and we cut them in each little notch. And then put one piece of shrimp on each hook on your sabiki rig. So remember these are a small mouse, so you don't need a huge piece of shrimp, just a little one. So we'll take the sabiki hook rig, just run through both pieces of shell out the other side those pinfish are going to try and suck that meat right out so you want them to suck in that hook so what you want to do is just let it slowly sink and you got it like it's a real light bite so you just kind of ease this down and just see if they'll they'll take it there we go it's a fish YouTube. So we just got to the dock, just got signed in. Now we're gonna go ahead and uh, wait to board the boat. Got everything unloaded. You can see we've got our stuff here. Pretty much that whole mess is ours. Bunch of people are already here, a bunch of regular folks, a bunch of new folks. But everybody's laying their stuff out, getting everything ready to go. So hopefully we'll have a nice epic trip. And uh, hope we get on a tutor tonight. Going, Danny. It's going. Big tired. Yeah, me too. Long drive. Long drive for Mr. Fan, hey. how you doing, you. man? Good I'm to see you see too. You. Uh, it's been a while. Sure. Fishing good? Good. You've been out? Awesome. Yeah. Looking hey, forward AJ's to it. Huh? AJ's big. Yeah. AJ, big AJ? Awesome. Gonna be a fun trip, my friend. I hope so, man. Sure. You know? That's what we come here for. Yep. Yep. Best boat around. Oh, sorry. Maybe two dozen? A dozen? About, yeah. I don't know. I'd two, just keep them in your bucket. Two dozen? Yeah. I would just keep them in That's your bucket. Right. Yeah. In your bucket. That, right. way, that way you're not fighting with the crowd over here. So we just leave the bucket back here? Yeah. Okay. That works, man.
Yeah, it's a little bee liner. Baby bee liner. That's what we're trying to catch, man. Yeah, I got another ridge. I guess we're catching grouper too. going to be stop three we're in 377 feet of water looks like there's a big drop off right there there's a bunch of life right there on the graph so hopefully Matt will give us position and we can make a drop and pick up some nice fish Let me go this way. 
got your room. Take a look at Mofo. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We got a fish on. Hold on, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Any young studs want to grab? Take a turn. I was all the way on the bottom. Small piece of squid. I think the shark is going up my hand. Yeah, there's definitely a shark. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Dude, my line is gone. There's a couple of them around. Yeah, my whole thing. Whatever this is, though. You want to help him? You need help, sir? Yeah. You want to help? Yeah. Nobody has to be a hero. So it's a beast or something. I just want to see it. I hope it's not a shark. If it is, though, it's one we can eat. Yeah, that'd be nice. But, I mean, I was using a boat rig with squid on it. So. I need to take a break here. Okay, you want to grab it? Okay, we got Keller, Jeep yeah, Keller. I hope it's not a red. Jeep Keller right there. Shark is right behind it. I'm not sure what it is, but. Oh, watch it, watch it, watch it, Mr. Fan. Stop, stop, stop. No! Just hang tight. There he is. You got him. Come on. He's right there. Ew. Oh, yeah. Flat line. Oh. Nice fit. Oh, yeah, he's a baby. We're going to get him back. You're going to have to use a lot heavier jig. Cheers, brother. Ours, bro. <laughs> Not too over that. So far, what? How have you been doing? I've got two big scams. Really nice. Yeah. I got a big AJ. Yeah. Yep. Stop. This is a deep 
drop spot and like 600 feet of water. I've just dropped to the bottom, had a cooked a fish, I'm bringing it back up. I still have 140 meters to go. So just trying to get it up here without losing it. You can see the rod tips popping back and forth, so trying not to get hooked on these jigs and everybody else is around the boat. Take my camera and just point it, get a good picture. It's recording. It's recording. Come on, we, we got you covered. Come on. All the way. Keep going. Nice, Mr. Fan. You got an electric reel. No, come on. Go Yeah, Come on down. Changing. I do five. And then I do 15, then I do 30, then I do 60, then I go back to 5, so I'm just working a water column, different depths. It's going out. Yeah. Come on around, keep going, keep going. Go. Come on, all the way around. You got one, Mike? Yeah. Hold on, we got one coming through. No, you can't, you can't even go in. I got, I got you. You go underneath? There you go. Come underneath. Come on. Come up here. Who's got a fish on? Right there. Those two, two guys do right now. Is that your drag, Mike? Yeah. Sweet, man. Yeah. 
Would you get Mike a shark? I don't know why. Well, probably a tuna, dude. I'm fighting like a shark. That's a tuna. These fish are mean tonight, man. These are big fish. They're not giving up. Mike's been fighting this tuna for a while. Finally coming to Gaff here. He had to pass off to a couple deckhands. These tuna are vicious today. Probably the worst tuna, strongest fighting tuna I've seen in a long time. It's perfect for them. Try to get back to my spot, but I haven't been able to yet. Hey Mikey! On the board! Way to go Mike! This is Mike's tuna. Nice yellow. Our neighbors to the left, right of us have two fish on. Our neighbor to the left of us has a fish on. Okay. That might not be a blackfish. That sounds like a yellowfish. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> You're not gonna break that rod. Huh? Yeah, rod. That's a bluefish rod. I'm gonna break the boat before you break That's that rod. If you need help, let me know. <laughs> Everybody thinks they want to catch a hundred pound yellowfish until they catch a hundred pound yellowfish. Let's move this good. It's our it's our rod. Come on, man, you got real. Lean back like that, real, real, real. Lean back, real, real, real. You up? Know, you got your belt on? Yeah. Not too high. Okay, now do the same thing. Broke the wine on. Broke the leader. Was big, huh? Yeah, it was big. You gotta put pressure on those fish to get them in the boat. You don't. Know, that's what will happen every time. This cut too? This looks like a bad knot. That's a bad knot. Uh, well, nothing. The only thing I would have seen is probably a shark. Video I think it is probably a shark. Alright, so unfortunately, my nice yellowfin tuna turned out to be a silky shark. So, what do we got over here? So, what you want to do with chunk is you want to cut, take your knife and get your right underneath the meat. So, you meet in the skin, make that little slit. Hook. What I'm trying to do is bury it all the way to that slit and then twist it and try and poke it out of the skin. So the only thing the tuna could even remotely see on that hook would be the little tiny piece of the tip of the hook sticking out through the skin like that. So what we'll do is when we go to throw this one in, I'll throw this in and you throw a couple of those in. That way, they're all water. Yeah, they'll all just go together.
Cast. A few sharks running around causing some problems. But it's a great trip right now. I might have to come your way, man. Go over me. Is this a yellow? I think so. Here we go, got color. Might be a sh I'm not sure what it is, Deckham. It's right there. Be a shark. 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 Cut me. Shark. Yeah. Okay, throw your halco, man. We're catching them up here like crazy. That one hit while I was trying to sink it. You got it? Bring them in. Yeah. There you go, Mikey. No, he's swimming towards you. He's not loose. Just keep the pressure on him. Don't let it. Don't let it up. Going out. Go throw. Go. If you can crank, crank the rod down, point the tip at it, and try to raise it up in the boat. Dickie, I need a gaff. It's a big black. Need a gaff over here. He needs a gaff. Yellow? No, it's a big black. It's not something we can lift in the boat. A belt. I dropped it right there. Don't trip over it. Thank you. 
got a fish? Um, so we're fighting a big something something we don't know yet. Could be a yellow fan, could be shark. We've got quite a few sharks. But um, what is it, Matt? I think it might be a shark. It, it was fighting like yellow, so it just ran right there. There's some buddies right there. We big sharks out here, man. Yeah. That's a garden variety small shark. I've been trying to avoid this year. It's been impressed with sharks. So that's the yellow fan. Yeah. Well, we caught a couple of nice ones here. We're at Hell Park and Eagle. So I mean, they're all in. Yeah. Just because there's so many other shots around, yeah, I mean, it yeah, makes me think it's not a tuna. I had to put a lot of heat on him because if that was a tuna, he just got part of him. I've been there Baby, de uh, baby yellow. Yeah. All right, YouTube. So get ready to wrap up another trip on a new bucket deer. Wasn't my personal best. I already caught a couple tuna, but overall the trip was very successful. We had one nice AJ. Actually caught a golden tile. Everybody got a bunch of vermilion, <laughs> a bunch of small black fin. So all in all, just another great trip on a new Buccaneer. Got to give a quick shout out and thanks to Captain Matt and his crew. They just have an amazing boat, amazing uh, experience for people to join. So I hope you all get a chance to check it out. And uh, so we'll see you on the water. That's Mike's yellowfin right there, number 73. So you can see we picked up a nice yellow in the Halco. So we got Paul Choi from 360. What's your uh, handle on 360? I think it's Paul Choi. Paul Choi. I get creative. Very, very difficult to understand <laughs> who's who. But yeah, I got Paul on here. Had a few other 360 tuna members. But you see, we caught some nice scamp. There's that little bitty golden tile. That's gonna be uh, dinner tomorrow. Uh, that, that created one heck of a tangle. Yeah, pretty much, pretty much everything did. Yeah. You see, there's some nice AJ we picked up. Yeah, it's like a 70 pounder up front. Really? 70 pound? Oh yeah, 71. I think it's mine. That's 71. Yep, so there's an AJ that uh, Mike and I and one of the Deckhands tag team on. That was a beast of an AJ. We got a few other AJs, a few other Alco, a few more Yellowfin hanging, and a whole bunch of beat on her. So, so as usual, YouTube, this was an epic trip. Again, if you're ever interested in doing some tuna fishing down on the Gulf, there's a bunch of different party boats down here. There's a Dolphin Dock, so further south. But out of Galveston, man, the new Buccaneers will want to get on. So hope you all enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave any comments, and uh, hopefully we'll see you out on the water.